This is the question of 2015, May, June, paper 1, 2, and the question number is 14. So it shows a ladder is positioned on IC or frictionless ground. This means the ground shown here is frictionless and is leaned against a rough wall, which means there we have got friction. So that means the wall has got friction and the ground has no friction. At the instant of release, it begins to slide. So that means the ladder will slide like this, somewhat like this. It goes somewhat like this or somewhat like this, like this and like this. So we have to identify which diagram correctly shows the directions of the forces P, W and R acting on the ladder as it slides. So you have to find the direction of the forces when it is sliding or when it slides. So let us first uh, consider the wall. So at the wall what happens is this is the wall, this is the wall and the ladder is uh, resting like this. So this wall has got friction. It's a rough wall. So when the ladder starts to slide, this point, this portion of the wall will try to come like this. So the friction of the wall will exert a force in upward direction. So the wall will exert a force in upward direction on this edge of the ladder. In addition, the wall also exerts a normal reaction force like this. So the resultant of these two will make the total force somewhat like this in this direction. So let's uh, see here. Only B and D fulfill this criteria in which the resultant force exerted by the ladder by the wall on the ladder is somewhat slanted direction like this B and D. So A, we can cross this A and C. Now at the ground, at the ground there is no friction at all. So that means the only force exerted by the ground on the ladder will be the reaction force given by the ground. Only force will be the reaction force. So which should be normal to the ground. And this criteria is fulfilled by choice number B. So choice number B should be the correct answer and D is incorrect.